So there's something called uh, <clears throat> Lion's Gate. Um, and um, so the Lion's Gate, of course, is talking about the what they call portal. There are some people who are going to say it's a portal, the Lion's Gate portal, call it the 888, okay? And the thing is that Lion's Gate, I'm texting someone here. Has got too many meanings. Has got too many what you can light. Okay? For example, um, when the sun is moving into the fifth house, or what you call in Rasta, or for the Rastafaris, this would be what you call um, uh, Lion of Judah. Okay, so we are in the times of the Lions of Judah now. This the whole of this month, it's the sun just moved into the fifth house. So, during the Lion of Judah, when you're supposed to be lighting your own torch, a.k.a. the sun, your sun, your mini sun, your descended, what you want to call your Christ consciousness, whether you want to call it your Jesus or your Venus or your Lucifer, a.k.a. your solar plexus, you, your individuality, your Christ, your Jesus, Wewe, when you are fearful, unasikianga kitu mbe tupita kwa tumbo, unasikianga when you are fearful, unasimanga, kutaigua maema hiho rada, that da, da, modromene da, for the kikuyus they know, modromene da, anikuli ya domegeta, waligua modu wenda geta, ukaigua modu wa geta, na ukuna modu wa, 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 wa huho joru, kogunia na vatra modu wa geta, oke ya rute, you are solar plexus, now, the people who have that magic of the Lion of Judah. Now, when the sun is in the fifth house, a.k.a. when the sun, we just left, ask anyone in the north, it is very hot now. It is the hottest summer. The sun is very hot. Wako summer holiday vizuri sana. So, during that time when you're supposed to be shining your own torch, your own torch, you don't shine your own torch. You shine the torch of the synthetic world, a.k.a. the Olympics. So, the Olympic torch. So, when you're supposed to give, 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 be giving yourself all that light, this little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. So, when you're supposed to be in your Lion of Judah, Eta, when you're supposed to be paying attention to your own solar plexus, the fifth house, the Jesus, the phoenix, Okay? Whatever you want to call yourself, you now, I'm talking about you. Okay? <clears throat> whatever you want to call yourself, Wanjiku, Joroge, or TNO, Kingston, whatever you name yourself, or I don't care about what you name you. We're talking about you now. So, when you're supposed to be expressing that, they create games, okay? The Olympics, the five squares, actually five circles, the five circles, the five circumstances, the five pillar, the five... The pentacle, okay? So they are going to use this, but then they are going to utilize what you call the Saturn magic, the, the Saturn uh, uh, magic square, the seven by seven, okay? So they create a games for you. So when you are in, because this is for the low hanging fruit, this is for the sheep. So for the sheep, they are thinking it's about sport, it's about the Olympics, so each and every religion has to send their people but they do it when the sun is in the fifth house in Leo. In Leo. Just before we get to the Lion's Gate portal. Before the opening of the Lion's Gate portals. Which are 8-8. Eight, eight. Eighth, 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 eighth month. The eighth date of August. The eighth month. The eighth, eighth portal. The Lion's Gate. The series. Uh, the Orion constellation. The Dreamworks. This is also the time they are going to release a lot of movies. Okay, so they are about to release... Eight, DreamWorks is going to release a movie. Uh, um, a Lighthouse Production has to release a movie. 
uh, anything that has got a light pixel has to release a movie because they are doing what you call their own global rituals. So they are hijacking where attention goes, energy flows. So they are attacking or taking your advantage or you hijacking it, whatever, whatever you want to call it. And they are using that energy for their own rituals, for their own rituals. Now, before we get to the rituals and how they are going to use that behind me, I'm going to tell you about that building behind me that is 330 meters high. 300 and 30, 33, that building behind me. I'll tell you why they are in Paris. It's not because that, that, what you call the Eiffel Park Tower, that is not, Italy, never forget that. We've been to France. Okay, you can only see that view from very beautiful hotels. France, they don't care. When are you thinking every day? Where would you history? France, what are you doing on Tuesday? France, when are you going to do on France, are you going to do on Monday? You know, when president, we are comedian. They don't care. They control France like nothing. France, when are you going to do on Tuesday? Where are you history? What are you going to do on Tuesday? Every day. So the building behind me, the Eiffel Tower. They have a river in Aka, Nairobi River. It is as dirty as Nairobi River. So, when Walikuwa na prepare for the Olympics, what will end a strike? So, Walikuwa mesema what uh, they were supposed to hold some uh, local marathon or something. Okay? They were supposed to hold it. So, what happened? They, they went to the town, Semenikesho. They went and shit. They went to that river. They had used so many billions to clean it. Na pesa ilikuwa imekuliwa. Kama hapa tu. So the youth waliamua nini? Atikesho muna hold these sports. Eh, tunakuja. So they went and they shit. They went and they shit by the river. So, iyo building unaona ya pari. You can only take pictures from afar. The same way ke yesi siu naeza ichukulia mbali. Apo chini ile chuma ni garbage. But that's not the most important thing. Because people don't... Nini wanenanga wanasikia mkisema pari wanashinwa ni nini? The same way mtu wanakujanga hapa anena na hapa Rift Valley viewpoint na watu wakijabi wawoni kama yu ni nini. It's just a tourist attraction. Watu wawuko they don't care. So weu kikea ati, oh my god, I wanna go to pari and take pictures there. It is the same way wazungu wanasemanga watafika huku lini wakapigwe picha masaimara. We mu Afrika, wake up your brains. Unafikia huko nyuma, you are not behind. The world is the same. Different levels of oppressions. Now, Let's talk about this, the Lions Gate portal before we get there. So, the Lions Gate portal in Akuanga, it's based more about what you can call spiritual growth. So, it's a time of spiritual growth and transformation. If you want a relevance from the Bible, think about it like this. When the year started, a.k.a. April 10, this year started in April 10, that is when we had our Vano Equinox, a.k.a. when you go outside, you don't need a watch, you don't even need anyone to tell you it is the start of the year. Ukisimama during midday, you have no shadow, ukiriatingi any shadow, unasimamanga saasita juu ikiwa juu yako, when you look around you, there is no shadow, meaning the sun, the moon, and the world, everything is aligned, the Vano Equinox. Now, the beginning of the year, not their calendar. But when you know what you're doing, you become dangerous. Now, when the beginning, it is usually March 26th to April 10. Most of the time, this year it was April 10. Because we have reset again for the seven years, the seven good years, a.k.a. In the Bible, the narrative where they were talking about the seven good years and the seven week years, a.k.a. Pharaoh had a dream and sent for that son of a gun to come and interpret the, the dream. And he told the king, the seven years are the seven years of abundance where you're supposed to reap in and keep for yourself because there's going to come another seven years where you not have much to feed on. So the seven years, so vision 2030, wake up to go 2024. So by the time we get to 2030, by 2031, before we start the first year now of the seven bad years in the Bible, mutakuwa mmejua jiji. Because for them, ni kujuekia, sayi ni kunyakua, nyakua. These are the seven abundance years. But instead of doing the rituals for yourself, you are doing for Olympics. You are giving all your energy to the news. You are giving all your energy to fake Trump news. That Trump anakuwa assassinated. That was an act. No one was assassinating him. It is an act. It is a drama. Wake up. 
at the Jew, a black woman was shot. No woman in the history of America will be shot and you are going to see the, uh, the, the body cam the next day. It will take years before you can convince the police to give you those body cams. So that is a psyop because they want women to be angry and say they are killing us and vote for Kamara Harris. Hata hapa Kenya amuku yona, amuku, sayi muna chezo, sayi muna chezo na nani, na, 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 what do you call this bastard? Son of a gun. Rigadi gashagwa. Sasa rigadi gashagwa tia meanza kusema tia tashikana na uhuru. Na muna chezo angwa, stop being distracted. Stop being distracted. Okay? Stop being distracted at all. Don't be distracted. Najuyayo, that's a message. That's a powerful message for me. You see, every day, even when you're doing, even like when I'm with you, I'm also doing shadow work. I just did some shadow work right there. Just replying that message was shadow work for me. When you may reply your message and what was on my mouth when I say stop being distracted and I Yeah. It's a confirmation. Back to the live. Forget about that. So now, that Lion's Gate portal, okay, has a lot of emphasis on what you can call spiritual growth and transformation. So the symbology behind the Lion's Gate portals, or the meaning, first we have what you call the astrological significance. So we have astrology, speculative, astronomy operative so anything you call astronomy is the operative part or the physical part or the witchcraft that has already been done or the terms and conditions that have been agreed to but the speculative the four fifth and sixth dimension the mind the mental will be the astrology okay so that lion's gate is associated with uh, what you can call rising of series okay series star so this is the brightest star in the sky, the Lion's Gate portal. So before you get to experience the Lion's Gate portal, they take all your energy. They shine it on Olympics. Then on those Olympics, the lighting of the torch, witchcraft, because where attention goes, energy flows, and they know that your subconscious does not know what is real or fake. So your subconscious thinks this is serious. This is the lion's gate. Because remember, your subconscious doesn't know what you do or see. Your subconscious knows about what that feels like. Your subconscious is, goes with not whether it's right or wrong, but what is that experience. Okay? Whether good or bad. So your subconscious, as a collective, you are praising the five circles, the, the Olympics with the torch being light. But there's another ceremony happening. So there's horses, there's magic, there's the Last Supper, okay, the, the Last Supper images on screen. the 2024 Olympics. So the Last Supper is happening, there's people, okay, there's gays, there's gays, a lot of gays. I'm not talking about LGBT, I'm talking of gays. There's gays him happening on stage. There was a man with his balls out. Balls out, inje, end of freeze, unaziona. There was a child in that last supper. So when they are doing their rituals, your spirit, your subconscious, it's being fooled. Your subconscious doesn't know that we are not here to the lion's gate portals, which will be on the 8th, 8th. So they hijack that energy. So that rising of Ceres, or what you call the brightest star in the sky, this which it is the light, it, is, it will be aligning with the earth and the sun. And they'll be doing that in Leo. Leo is your fifth house, your solar plexus. So that is where it will be aligning. So we are going to have earth. What is earth? Practicability. Your ability to anchor things down, make them firm. 
Where else? What is the sun? The sun is your expression. What we see, who you are. And where will that be happening? It will be happening in Leo or the Lion's Gate, the fifth house, the Lion of Judah in the Bible. So this is supposed to be opening a gateway to higher realms of consciousness. You're supposed to be updating a, like a firmware, like the same way your phone goes from uh, 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 Samsung 25 or you go from Android 1, 2, 3, 4. When that is happening, you're supposed to be going through your own firmware update, your own gateway to a higher realm. You're supposed to awaken into even more than what we can see now. But they know that this is for everyone as a collective and it may happen to you by accident. You wake up, you're like, shit, I'm in the matrix. Shit, why do I even wake up in the morning? Shit. So what do they do? They create a game. Remember, it's a game. Olympic games. When you unakuanga kwa games, when you unakuanga ukifikiria ni mchezo, it's not about games. They create the games as distraction. So you are distracted. Oh my God, I'm in the police. Bang, bang, bang. But no, no. It, the sun just moved into the fifth house. You should be getting ready to do your farmware, to do your more expansion, to grow spiritually. If you are scared, go to church. This is not your channel, okay? Tembeza kiatu. This is for big mind only. Big minds, hapa. Hakuna babies, hapa. This is not for baby spirits. If you are a baby spirit, keep it moving. Okay? Now, this is the what you call the symbolism now. So, 8-8, eight, eight. remember, it is the fifth, the fifth moon, I mean uh, sun, but you are still using the dates because this is how they set the magic square. So as a collective, since you are already following that calendar, nyu, 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 see, nyu, me, me, I don't follow that calendar. Me, I'm already in, in, my, in, my, in my fifth month. I already know that. Me, I'm never left behind. Not anymore. Najua, munasema mukosiju August, kwaza inakuanga, it becomes an issue for me because I don't even remember to pay my rent. Sometimes they be like, hey, you are renting. I'm like, oh, shit. Oh, and then I remember, ah, me, I'm, me, I'm on another different counting. Me, I'm on the third month. And uh, you, know, you know what I'm saying? So that 8-8 eight, eight is considered very powerful in humanology because 8 symbolizes balance, the two zeros, infinity, metaverse, that loop, okay? It symbolizes what? A balance, infinity or what you can call cosmic order. So this represents a period of heightened energy and potential, potential for spiritual awakening, but you never awaken because they are always creating the, the distraction for you and diversion for you and games for you. Shout out to the Sabbath, today is the Wednesday, so I'm, I'm blazing, I'm blazing, I'm blazing hot. This, this is my sword, this is my, this is my blazing sword. Pay some respect. I'm the militia for God today. Now, so, remember, we have what you are calling now the Leo's influence or the influence of the fifth sign, okay? Which is ruled by what? The sun. What does that represent? What does the lion represent? Shout out to my daughter, she's a Leo, and I'm a Leo moon, okay? So, Leo is ruled by the sun. What does the sun represent? Courage. Shout out to, to, to Tim Bonnie. Team Boni, Team Courage, Strength, and the Hot-Headed Consciousness. So during that Lion's Gate portal, okay, your thoughts are supposed to amplify those qualities. Courage, Strength, because that is the representation of the Sun or the Lion, the Lion of Judah in the Bible. Shout out to all the Rasta men. They don't even know their holidays here. The Rasta men are, you know, they are poor Rasta men. You know, they have been given the watered down version of Rasta. Okay, they don't, they just think, we are Rasta, Rasta man. You know, the watered down version, the poor reggae. You know, there's the rich reggae and the poor reggae. Shout out to Von Benjamin Akaibeka for the high reggae consciousness music. So, this is supposed to be encouraging you to tap into your inner power and to express your true selves. You know, it's easy. Whatever you are known for, it's what you're supposed to be known for. Non-stop. 
you are going for the money regardless unaona yuna unanoya didere wa matatu saini unafaa ku spin na kegokora hii kegokora hivi it is your time nothing can happen to you sasa hizi hata unaweza endesha gari na mguu ukijua venye unafanya it is the sun in leo that is even why now they are going to make you do the olympics and break records watu wanaruka juu yeah! Unafikiria ati ati ni si Olympics witchcraft wewe wacha ujinga wewe it is your time to jump high it is your time time to break records it is your time to 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 face your your most fiercest uh, uh, intruder and and go through them that courage that leo so they create games for you to divert your energy so that you miss the opportunity to go through your spiritual awakening wamepiga nduru kwa radio Radio is propaganda. Umesikia hiyo nduru venye imekupea disturbance. Now all of a sudden you are scared. But lazima wangepiga nduru for me. Shout out to nduru. It's Leo energy. I don't need you to cheer for me. I just know it has been confirmed. Watu wanapiga nduru wajui venye kunaenda. Now there's other connections of course ancient. They are talking about the Egyptian culture. Okay so they are talking about the rising of Ceres okay linked to the flooding of the Nile so when you go to the Nile is when the Nile would bring all the fish all the harvest to them sasa wanaweza panda ilikuwa ni the start of the new year symbolizing rebirth symbolizing renewal ukitaka kujua enda river Nile sasa hizi is flooded ni nini bana sasa ni nini tunasumbuana okay so already that is adding to that beginnings that transformation Hakuna kitu hidden you just have to wake up but nothing is hidden The lion's gate portal It's a time for spiritual activation and awakening we just went through the two full moons in Capricorn Do you know what that means Two full moons in one sign That was a firmware update Already kuna watu wako mbele sana spiritual hata kuna watu saizi utai waona tena you never see them again all of a sudden wametoka internet wame 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 wame, wame disable all the applications lights have gone off in their minds now wameamua sasa ni spiritual the way it's supposed to be wengine watauza vitu zao they go and they buy land they start living off grid wachipe maji waweke solar you never see them again their farm we update was unplugging ile ukweli okay so this is a time for spiritual activation awakening okay so it is considered um a very high vibrational uh, 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 energy time it's supposed to help you release old patterns so this is a time for healing this is a time for letting go of that which does not serve you anymore it no longer serves you you may think it was serving you it's no longer serving you it's not for you anymore so now is the time to align with your soul purpose what is your soul purpose now is the time to manifest your desires not for the olympics for you as above so below it's free you don't have to pray you don't have to go to church you don't have to go sijui 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 go go around a stone in the ground and suck it screaming that, that, that you don't have to do all those things it's free firmware update and them they are doing it when you ufany we unajua we ujui we unafikiria ni olympics but to them they are already doing it let me show you how they are doing it so the Eiffel Tower keyword tower tower Eiffel Tower it is used one as an observatory base ni kweli ama si kweli people go to the Eiffel Tower to do what to look through a binoculars the Eiffel Tower okay okay it was named after its own engineer alikuwa anaitwa Gustave Eiffel when was it built between 1887 kuna two eights 1887 ikamalizika 1889 sio 1890 1889 so from 1887 those are two eights between 1887 ni 1887 ikamalizika 1889 pay attention pay attention so we have two eights the lions gate portal 88 coming up Iko from the day they started 1887 by design remember it's an observatory deck 
observatory you are supposed to go there and observe wewe unafikirianga oh my god i'm looking at what look take the binoculars what do you see ah that is the famous paris where whoever whoever no 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 they are suppo- they are observing when you wanajua renanga hapo wana observe they know where to look they know where to look and they know what to see right now the world is there it's an observatory what are they observing that 88 Remember it started in 1887 1887 ikaisha 1889 ikaisha 1889 ingeisha 1890 but ingeisha hivyo because there's a reason listen it is a broadcasting tower the ifo opari broadcasts it's a broadcasting tower and it's a observation tower you can go and google check meaning meaning what is broadcasting broadcasting to the world casting broad recasting so the eiffel tower is a broad recasting observation tower where is it located in semanakanga iko on the 7th arrondissement in paris 7th arrondissement in paris what are the coordinates it is 48 degrees 51 29 6 north 2 degrees 17 4 40.2 east it started its construction in 28th january 1887 now jump into your zodiac sign 27 uh, 1887 28th january when was it completed listen it was started in january 28 Janus 28 Now pay attention What is January 28 on the zodiac sign Usha pata sindio This is the other thing it was completed 31st March 1889 double 8 31st March now Nimekuambia nini about March na April? What happened between March 26 and April 10, the beginning of the year? So, when did the year start? That first March 1889. It was 135 years ago. 135 years ago. Now. Um the architecture of the building, the Eiffel Tower the architecture or what you call the measurements of the thing how tall that is stand you have to understand it stands 330 meters 330 meters no 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 300 meters sorry 300 meters 300 meters is how tall the eiffel tower is 300 remember pay attention 3 the tip the tip it stands at 300 it has a tip the tip is 330 meters Zuka unashika The whole building ni 300 meters The tip ni 330 meters The top floor 276 meters Now that is not important what is important what they mean in feet Architectural 984 feet The tip 1083 feet Top floor 906 foot. Why 906? 906 ukisoma from behind is 3906. Whether it's upside down or inside out, it is 3906. Now, it is something that they call a floor count. A floor count. If you go to it, Junitawa aina 1 2 3 4, they have a floor count. Their floor count is 4. But on a semanga, what is accessible is 3 plus 1 called a residue you are following you come on a follow you come on a follow now the eiffel tower is on the banks of a river what is called the bank of seine seine in french s e i n e and it's supposed to be um what is that word criteria criteria Ukisikia jina criteria always understand is not talking about a criteria it's talking about something cultural 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 
It has an inscription. 1991 inscripted on it. 1991, which is 1661. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> away from the uh, from the Paris. Welcome to the Paris. I love the Olympics. You know we love the Olympics. We are gonna enjoy the Olympics. I'm not telling you not to enjoy the Olympics. Go and enjoy the Olympics. The Olympics are a very good game. Go and give away all your energy. Okay, you know you can enjoy something without giving away your energy, a.k.a. without getting the, ooh, ah, remember, those things that you are calling demonic, the opening, those things you are calling the demonic, oh my God, it's so demonic, oh my God, they, they are trying to, to remind us what happened before the COVID, and it came to happen, these Olympics, they are so satanic, oh my God, is that the pale horse, the pale horse of the Bible, oh my God, these people are so demonic, wait, wait, stop getting distracted. Now you are giving them your power. Now that's where now they get you. You're supposed to look at things like nothing. Oh, what is that? It's a horse. Ah, that must be very funny, having a horse on top of water. These people, these humans are very weak. That must be very funny. Why, why do they do that? Ah, oh, the rounds get put. Oh, the sun. Oh, the series is coming. Okay. Oh, so it's a distraction. Okay. Ah, man, that is weak magic, you know. Why would you do that to people? Like, make them pay attention to nonsense. For a game when they should be paying attention to themselves. Oh, you know, no. Oh, okay. Anyway, we have to rule them. Eh? We have to keep them occupied. Yeah, of course. We do, what do we want? We want them to buy after Olympics. Yes. What are they going to buy? They are going to buy Nike. They are going to buy the clothes that the people, the companies that win endorsements. Ah, who owns the endorsement? It is us. Whose business? It is us. Whose name? Us. Whose name is on that in that paper? The dollar. Us. Ah, we own the we own the world. Okay. Be focused, do not be distracted. No, they are not mocking their Jesus, they are mocking your Jesus, your solar plexus. You are the one who is supposed to be centered, not distracted. Them, they know what they are doing. And actually what they are doing is very weak magic, because we can see it. Imagine we can see it. I'm not supposed to see magic like that. We can see their magic. That is how cheap it is. Like, we just have to look at it like, ah, come on, man. Man, yani hata munanga idea. Si munge jaribu kitu ingine. Munge, man, work a little bit harder. This is so cheap, man. But it doesn't care why. It works. Look at all of you in the internet. Oh, my God. It's a four horse, man. Oh, my God. It's evil. No, it's not evil. It's not evil. Dress. The Lion of Judah. Dress now. Every day for yourself. Watch your keep it out when I say, Wah! Light your own torch. Wear those heels now. Step in the name of love. Step, step, step in the name. It's your time to shine. This month is your time to shine. Ona your dream, unakuanga nayo, go for that dream. Stop giving your energy to, to the Olympics. Give it to the true power. Lions get portal. However you do it, it's up to you. You don't have to go to church. You don't have to worry. You don't have to uh, pray. You don't have to do whatever. Just know it's happening and just know it's your time to shine. Lion of Judah in the Bible now. Come on now. Shout out to the Rasta people. But they don't even know. The Rasta are like, oh my God, I'm a Rasta man. He's a Rasta man. Even if I have no dread, I'm a Rasta man. You don't have a dread to be Rasta. Poor man's Rasta. Shout out to the real Rastas though. No disrespect. Sasa. And shout out to the Lounge Gate Portal. Do have a beautiful afternoon. Again, another Saturn day. It was a day of, um, uh, you know, uh, uh, you know what I'm saying? Um, whatever. Very more or a kawadayo dayo. Dan Prince KE. So, yeah, we'll catch up later. Maybe if you feel like catching up, who knows? Could be the end of the world tomorrow. Who knows? Your world. Make sure that when your world ends, it ends with a smile on your face. Be the person who dies with a smile on your face, always laughing at the world and making light of the moment. Because when your transformation comes, it will happen in a second. Make sure that 
second you go off with a smile even if it's an accident you be smiling at how fake it is that you have to die in an accident like man could have come with another solution but he decided to come up with a solution of cars passing each other with the risk of having an accident so you're gonna smile as you die like man that was some weak magic you could have done better and laugh at yourself i know it takes is for you to be in that laughing moment that light moment and you go to a higher heaven where you didn't die with a sucking face, you died with a smile on your face. So you ascended, you went to your little heaven, a lighter version of yourself. So when you are reborn, reincarnated or incarnated or incarnate or canate, at least you go into a lighter form that finds light of everything, aka light as in weight, laughter, the best medicine. Do have a good one.